think of sporting records and immediately Sergei Bubka, the Ukrainian pole vaulter, comes to mind. 35 world records, indoor and out, and his 6 meter 14 leap in Italy in 1994 has yet to be approached, let alone beaten. From a truly outstanding athlete, Bubka's mutated into an influential figure in the sports world, an International Olympics committee member and president of the Athletes Commission. Euronews met the legend during the Sportel 2007 convention in Monaco. Your world record still stands. Why do you think today's vaulters can't get anywhere near it? How do you explain why your record has stood so long? I always try to develop my technique. I try to focus to improve the results. I did my job very well and I'm really pleased what uh, I did through my sport career. I was really passionate and enthusiastic and excited for Paul Vault. The men are stagnating and aren't able to get anywhere near your world record, but the women are improving year on year. What do you think of their performance and in particular Yelena Isenbaeva's? We have uh, good development in women Paul Vault. We have uh, good, good athletes, good personality as Yelena Isenbaeva. This is making this event very popular, very famous and bring attention for our sport to athletics. But to jump over five meters for women, I, I would say this is really, really uh, great performance. Despite all the criticisms that have been made about next year's Olympics, for example, the violation of human rights or pollution in Beijing, do you think this will be a good Olympic Games? If we can look in the last six years, you can see unbelievable change in positive way with human rights and we can see the also positive way that country become more and more open it's it's a uh, media can write and they invest in a lot of money for pollution to improve uh, the environment this is we can see because i'm travel very often i am member of coordination commission i think it's uh, Olympic Games, it's really brought to China uh, a lot of positive changes. What do you think about Marion Jones's confession to being a drugs cheat and the other recent scandals? Of course it's very negative that uh, the Marion Jones uh, become an athlete who used forbidden substance and we need to look exactly what is the reason, what kind of evidence is, uh, is there. But I think it's we're getting stronger for that reason. We can see and we can catch the, the athletes who choose the wrong way, who wants uh, to be cheated. And if we touch also the IOC decision that IOC also planning after 2008, it's already decision is done. If the athletes was uh, dubbed over six months uh, a penalty, this athlete will not participate in, in uh, the next Olympic Games. The 2012 European Football Championships will be in Ukraine and Poland. The 2014 Olympics are in Sochi in Russia. Is Eastern Europe becoming the new destination for international sport? No, Eastern part is developing very fast, very rapid, and of course it's UEFA uh, decide to, to give the European Championships 2012 uh, to Ukraine and Poland, and I was a part of the process and the bidding process for my country and of course uh, we are very happy and proud to host the championships and we are looking to work very hard to bring successful European championships in 2012. We've been taking bets in the office on how high you'd go if you picked up a pole today. Five meters? No, but five you are joking. This is five. It's Five is very easy. It's much higher than five. More than 550 for sure.